I am Paul Cornett, co-owner of Cornett Dairy in Luxembourg and a member of Peninsula Pride Farms. Uh, I'm a participant in this project because from the time Peninsula Pride Farms formed uh, seven years ago, uh, we knew we needed to do a better job of telling our story and explaining to especially the non-farm members of our community uh, what we were doing to be good stewards of the land and water. Uh, but we also knew we could do a better job. And it seemed, I think, strange or uh, uncomfortable for a lot of us to have to say that we cared, but we needed to let people know that we did care about our natural resources. At the same time, it was always a goal uh, to collect some data and to document um, the changes that we were making and demonstrate the improved outcomes uh, that come along with implementing new practices. Uh, along the way, uh, several member farms, including mine, have participated in some smaller studies to help do that. Uh, we did one regarding soil loss and phosphorus a couple of years ago. And uh, this project is by far the most comprehensive uh, reaching out into energy use, greenhouse gas, uh, along with uh, several water quality metrics. My goal moving forward, uh, along with just being able to figure out where I'm getting the most bang for my buck on the farm, uh, implementing new practices, uh, I, I spent a lot of time entering data and trying to figure this program out because I know uh, through participation in the group that the data we're collecting has value uh, all along the supply chain. Um, our, our dairy plants and processors, meat processors, all the way on up to retailers uh, and, and consumers want to know where their food comes from. Uh, we're hoping that, or I'm hoping that uh, by participating in these kind of data collection efforts that we're going to be able to funnel that information uh, through the supply chain and hopefully create a value-added product one day that will return uh, a reward for some of this hard work. Uh, if you'd like to learn more about year one of this three-year project, uh, you can check us out at PeninsulaPrideFarms.org or FarmersForSustainableFood.com.